This video is to demonstrate how you can see your grades as well as instructor feedback on your assignments for this course. It will also show you how to see the grading rubric for each assignment, both before and after submission, so you can have an awareness of the point structure that was used in grading your submissions. You start over on the left side of the page and we're going to click on grades. When you click on grades, this tab opens up and it will list all of the assignments that have been assigned for you so far within the module. Now keep in mind, depending on when in the semester you are looking at this, at the beginning, there'll be very little, but as you progress, there will be quite a few items. Now, for all items that have been graded, you will see a number and a percentage. The number 12 out of 15 gets an 80% on this assignment for the student. It will also show any comment or feedback the instructor typed in on that assignment, uh, like a message to you regarding, sometimes it's regarding grading, sometimes it, it's related to content, those type things. You'll see another one with forums, and again, point structure and percentage. The student scored 23 out of 35, which gave them 65.71%. But you will notice there's no commenting on forums. The feedback does not appear on this page for forum grading. It will appear on this page for uh, regular assignments, but for feedback on forum grading, you need to go back into the actual forum itself. So this particular one, Introductions Forum, and if you scroll all the way down, right next to where you add a topic, it will say View Grades. When you click on View Grades, after you have submitted it, it will show you the rubric with this point structure of where you scored in each category. For example, on this student, you can see on the original post, they scored an 18 out of a 20. And then it will also show you instructor feedback that they gave you on that portion. And then of course, the next category, and once again, here's the score in this case. It is very lightly shaded, you have to look, but in this case, it's zero. Up here, you can see it was an 18. But again, there is instructor feedback explaining some of the scoring. And then once again, on the next category and then on the final category. So you can see if the instructor chooses to give you comment and feedback and type some things in, this is where you are going to view that feedback on your scoring, as well as note the point structure that was graded on your particular assignment. Now, for assignments that you maybe have not yet done, you can still see that same grading rubric or any grading rubric ahead of time. So when I go into another forum, that is not yet graded, and I'm going to get ready to do my posting or my replying, and I want to make sure I know what the instructor is scoring on or what they're gonna be looking at. Once again, you click on that same tab, view grades. You're going to get the exact same thing, except it'll all be blank. But this gives you a really good idea uh, oh, okay, so my post is worth up to 20 points, so on and so forth. In what category, what's the maximum number of points and also criteria associated with scoring those particular points. You can also see rubrics in regular assignments. So for example, if I click into the email etiquette assignment and you scroll, it will provide the grading rubric that will be used in scoring that particular assignment when a rubric is applied. Keep in mind, not all assignments have rubrics for scoring, but a great deal of them do. And this helps you look at, okay, what will the instructor be scoring me on? Now, in this case, the rubric is very close to the instructions, 
But in some case, you may have to scroll all the way down uh, quite a bit to see it because it will depend on how much the instructor has given you in this instruction area. And of course, some instructions are much more detailed than others. So I hope you found this video helpful to find grades and also see grading rubrics both before and after assignment submissions.